All right, and we're back again. Like I said, I'm going to be mixing it up because, you know, I've sat on the sideline long enough. I checked out a lot of different things. I want to talk about films, but it's kind of hard to do that when there's some real statements that need to be made. So much going on right now in our, in our sphere of politics in, in our country. I don't think anybody's mind is on anything else right now except the future because we have an uncertainty going on, right? So... Good news, kiss your ass hello, we're still here. The election has come and gone. I'm looking outside my window. I don't see any Proud Boys or white militias or Nazis or anybody outside my window. So nobody's tearing up nothing yet. Yet, okay? So that's the first part. <laughs> now we just got to get through the inauguration. I mean, it becomes official. So it's a long period of time between now and then. The might as well be, you might as well be just able to touch the moon. <laughs> but you can't, you know. So, um, the election is over. It came and went. How you voted is your business. It's your prerogative. Voting is supposed to be anonymous. I don't know why they try to tell people how to vote or say who you should vote for, or this or that or that or this. It's a privilege how you vote to keep it to yourself. That's also a law, you know. Nobody can coerce you to vote for someone. That's it. Bottom line, period. Um, I'm going to discuss this video. This is going to be part one of the video. And then I'll let you guys know when part two will start. Part 2 is going to be available on my Patreon. If you want to join up and become a Patreon member, Part 2 of the video will be on my Patreon. So, here we go. First off, I can only speak for my, my, my breed, my brethren, black men, black men in America. This is not our fight, okay? We need to step back from this and let them do what they're going to do. We need to be on the sidelines. We don't need to be thinking about what didn't happen, what should have happened, how we can make this. No, no. First off, they're not listening to us anyway. They haven't ever been listening to us, okay? I remember I need to find it so I could talk about it in the second video. It was a, um, it was a um, gentleman, a black man at a convention Democratic convention, I believe, and he's trying to speak and give his speech. And I remember as a kid watching this, it was like a movie or a documentary. And all you hear is the crowd, which is mostly full of white people, just shouting and yelling and drowning him out. And he loses his composure from it. And he's no longer even trying to say his speech. He's just trying to tell them, listen to me, listen to me, let me speak. You see what I'm saying? Bro, nobody want to hear what we got to say about the presidential election. Nobody wants our insight, okay? They skipped over us. They went right to the black women. They skipped over the black women, went right to the Latino women. And <laughs> I, I should you not. Look it up. Nobody want to hear what we got to say. You know, they don't. So we need to stay on the sidelines. If they're going to tear them shoes apart, that's fine. I'm not going to get in the way. You shouldn't either, okay? So with that... That ends the first part of the video. Now, if you want to hear the juicy meat of what I have to say about this and help you understand what's really going on, the things, things that you don't see, the things that you don't understand, and how the game, man, is so fucking tight, how they play the whole country, get on Patreon and you can uh, see the second part of this video. It's going to be available right after this. So, <clears throat> Now, 